Tomorrow I have the CFDA awards. I am going and sitting at the table with Coach. Shout out Coach. And then the next day, I kind of have to work like the FIFA World Cup trophy tour, which is by Coca-Cola. Hello everyone. I hate when I press record and have like totally lose my train of thought. Train of thought. Bear with me. Okay, I just woke up. And let me explain where I am, because this is not my bed. So this morning, or last night, I had a red eye to New York. And that's where we are now. So I am now in New York. I'm here for like three days. I feel great. I feel like I got technically like a full eight hours in a sense. Like I slept on a five hour flight all the, the whole way. And then got like a three hour nap. So just showered. And now we're going to go get some coffee. And you guys are coming along for that. Me, Maxwell, and Vinny. Travel gang. We're all here. In the meantime, you guys can look at that snazzy New York view. Are you kidding? Look at those pigeons fly. I genuinely do really love this place. New York. All right, we're gonna give her a go. Amazing to be fair. Every time you come to New York, it's actually kind of dangerous. Cause like I, you guys know this. I just got my place in LA, but I'm reconsidering like literally selling it and just moving. <laughs> nah, I'm playing. I love my spot in LA, but like, come on. I just want to live here and just walk around. Oh, and before I go, to anyone who grew up in New York, what's it like? Like growing up, like your childhood in New York. Did you? Was it like the movies? Did you guys like throw rocks at their windows and like climb up on their fire escapes? Come on. Heading back to the hotel for a quick pit stop, and then onto the fitting. There I am. I love it to be fair. Bro, the art, just looking around in New York is so fun. Save the duck. More night. Do your thing. Bad attempt at a fit check. My hair's like extra curly today, I don't know why. Cute. Alright guys, we're gonna go shop and walk around for a little, but I'm not gonna take you because not gonna lie, you guys are kind of a drag though to carry. <laughs> you guys are just kind of a high maintenance. But what I will do is if I get anything, I will come back and give you guys a little haul. In the meantime, y'all can enjoy this view. What if I just left you guys here for free? <laughs> Alright, we're gonna go. I'll come back and give y'all a haul. What we did, we went shopping. Got some stuff, I'm gonna haul for you guys, I promise. Then, after shopping, we went to dinner and we ate at this like, Asian restaurant and it was very good. We sat at the bar, you know, it felt so like, <sighs> got the hiccups. Adult, if you will. Then after, we walked off a little, you know, and then Maxwell called it a night at like seven. It's getting old, all right? But Vinny and I were like, look, we're gonna, we're gonna power through it, you know? So we did that and Vinny and I literally rode city bikes for two and a half hours. Nevertheless, I will do a little haul for you guys. Number one, we went to Second Street. First thing that we got, we got this wonderful, like if you were here to feel this, this feels so good. It's like a, if you can look closely, it's like, guys, I don't know what color this is. It might be like a green, navy, blue, like mix, but it's cute. It's a cardigan with the Yankees. It's from Kith. Love this, great find. These might be the grail of my thrifting experience due to the fact that these are very in right now and look i'm not much of like a trendy shopper mm, i take that back i i enjoy a good trend don't get me wrong but for the most part i try to dress like timeless in a sense these are kind of trendy i'm not gonna lie i wouldn't get this color at retail price i would get it for a resale price which i did because i was thrifting and these are 33 dollars. these are wales bonner hamburg collab sambas suede some of us are just in right now. And if and if you get it, you get it. You know, if you don't, get out of here, you know? I also got these very fun jeans. These jeans are so fun. They're like 
huge. But I tried them on, they stack so nicely and they're just like fun, you know, I don't have a pair of like this washed denim. And then we got, look. I said I'm not much of a, a trendy shopper, but like Gorp core and like tactical wear type stuff, almost like hiking gear is like in right now. And like it's fall time and I don't, like I've never seen anyone with this color, but it literally is just this guy right here, like that. And then I got these, these cargo pants. These are from Carhartt and I literally just needed a pair of like black cargo pants that are just like, I can just throw on for whatever. We were walking around and then we saw a store that I literally am obsessed with. It's called Nanushka, okay? Bear with me, Nanushka. And I was like, uh, okay, so we're going in. Oh, it's just amazing. I was overwhelmed with like, I want this, I want this. So I ended up only getting two things, but one of them is like a really, really big like baby blue puffer, like leather. And then I got another thing with that, which was like a knitted like brown polo type thing. That, that, that's, that's my haul. Didn't expect to come here and shop, but then we had a free day. And then tomorrow is CFDA awards. I might call it a night right now, but tomorrow I'm gonna wake up, work out, probably get some coffee or something. And then we start getting ready. All right, I'm rambling. I just want to keep talking to you guys, but I really am going to go to shower, lay in bed, probably watch a little bit of YouTube, maybe, honestly. I like YouTube. All good? Gua sha before bed. I'm going on a run. Hello? <laughs> Alright guys, we're making a TikTok right now. <laughs> Vinny had an idea. You guys are getting the full BTS. This is in the middle of grooming, by the way, for the CFDA awards, and we're making this. <laughs> <laughs> so what? So it's we are on our way to the Beekman Hotel for cocktail hour. Vinny is killing it with the assistants right now. <laughs> He's chugging that. Yeah, we're going for a little cocktail hour um, prior to the CFDA awards. Hair looks not it right now. Okay, but let me explain to you what's going on here. You may be like, no, that's a new hotel. What are you doing there? Like, is this two different trips, you silly goose? No, it's two different hotels. The first half of the trip was for fashion. So that was paid for by Coach and CFDA. So I had a great time with the event last night. We're done with the fashion part of the trip, which was great. But then we moved to hotels because now, but wow, this natural light, it's kind of amazing. But yeah, now, now this is the soccer part of the trip, which is fun. I'm hosting something for the FIFA World Cup, like a trophy tour, and doing like a little artist competition today, so I'm really excited for that. Maxwell's house is falling apart. Literally and <laughs> metaphorically. While we're away trying to be productive on business, this is the last thing that you want to hear is that your house has a leak. Gushing geyser from That's my ceiling. ceiling. It is what it is. It is what it is. The <laughs> <laughs> sun will come up. Break. Alright guys, how's everyone? That was chaotic. I don't really know what just happened. It was like content capture with the trophy. Like that was the actual World Cup trophy, which is kind of nuts to be fair. Oh, I met Kaka. <laughs> what a nice guy, an absolute gent and a legend to be fair. Like I, I watched him growing up. We're gonna get food. You guys don't really need to see Vinny and I crushing some bows. However, I might bring you, I'll decide. Yeah, I'll see you. I'm gonna text Vinny, bye. Three, two, one. And we welcome you to the FIFA Dream.
What's up guys, just got back to the hotel. What a fun event, you know. I was kind of stressed a little because I was a little worried about like talking and like announcing and doing all the hosting stuff. But it was fun, easy, it was a great crowd, everyone was super chill. Decided I think we're gonna go ice skating. We have a reservation from 11 to 12. Really excited, I don't wanna take you guys with me because I don't wanna be worried about you guys. I'm gonna take you guys with me, okay? I promise. She's really pretty. Oh, we're locked and loaded. Fasha was just saying what a bucket list item for a New Yorker, he's never been. Proud father. Bro, I need that penguin for real. The ice warrior right here. Thank you. That was well done. Wow. The dogs are barking and they are free. That is it for our time here in New York City. What an absolute pleasure. Honor. It is. I love this place. My heart has very, very, like I knew I would love this place. And if you've been in New York, you know what I'm talking about. If you haven't, mm, sucks for you. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> this is me manifesting that you will get to experience New York one day. That being said, I felt like I needed to wrap the night with something and something needed to like seal the envelope. Like I needed like some kind of pastry, some kind of like, whether it was snack or a drink that just wasn't water. What I do have is my leftover banh mi. So that being said, I'm just gonna crush this and then literally hit the hay. Then we gotta get up tomorrow, get back to LA tomorrow about like 2 p.m., I believe, and then go on about our day. That being said, I just wanted to say thank you guys for everything, like from the bottom of my heart. You guys are the reason I'm doing this, literally giving me a job, giving me a career, what if you will, whatever. And yeah, I'm excited to see what we can do together, uh, you and I. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I hope it, you took something for, from it. And genuinely, if you guys like this video, give it a big thumbs up, um, hit that like button. If you liked it, only if you liked it. Comment, yeah, comment ideas that you want. Cause I think my traveling until the holiday is minimal. I'm going to Qatar for the World Cup and that's about it. I'm definitely gonna do some videos around the house or in LA, so hit me with some fresh ideas. Comment all that, hit the like button, subscribe, turn those post notifications on. That's about it. I'm, I'm gonna go to bed and I hope you guys enjoyed. I love you. Till next time. Wait for it, not her, that. This life is good. Geico, in like, in a respectful way, I was literally just like, eh, they'll be fine. You know, you guys see enough of me.